so effectively any aggression. The British accent of the Islamic State jihadist in this propaganda video, purportedly showing the beheading of U.S. journalist James Foley, is enough to force British Prime Minister David Cameron back from holiday. The clip, which is still being verified, has sent chills around the globe. In it, Foley was forced to read a statement blaming America and even his own brother John, who is in the U.S. Air Force, for his killing. The man in black warns that another journalist, Stephen Joel Sotloff, will be their next victim. 40-year-old Foley was taken hostage in November 2012 while covering the Syrian war for Global Post. He had previously been captured and released in Libya. Foley's mother said her son gave his life to expose the suffering of the Syrian people. On Twitter, hundreds of users urged the public to neither watch nor share the video, which was taken down shortly after it was uploaded. The White House said if the video was genuine, the US would be appalled.